Hey guys, just me, your big boy here. So uh, last year I bought and, and did my second unboxing video on my channel, which is the unboxing for the WWE uh, Red version of the Universal Championship, uh, which is the uh, collectible titles on my way made by uh, Wicked Cool Toys, uh, which uh, it came in a box like this. So uh, and now, and now the question is, uh, why did I keep this box? Oh man, I mean, it's simple because uh, it is a pretty it is a pretty cool looking box, and, 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 and it featured like a three superstars like Roman Reigns, Kevin Owens, and Finn Balor, and uh, and uh, well, even though I still think to this day that uh, that I'm like my main my main issue with this is that like it doesn't feature like like what other wrestlers are who held this uh, red version Universal Title belt, like Brock Lesnar, Goldberg, and Seth Rollins. So so yeah, eh, I mean I guess. Uh, I don't know when exactly um, they released this uh, they, they released this belt from from Wicked Cool Toys. I'm a, I I know that I'm a, I'm a, there was another uh, belt like uh, like the WWE Championship belt, you know, which which I know it featured like uh, someone like Daniel Bryan, Jinder Mahal, and, and AJ Styles. So, uh, but uh, I, I didn't get that one because um, I got the Jack Pacific one instead. So, but yeah. All right, on to this. So, uh, okay. Today I'm going to be doing a, another comparison video because uh, because a week and a half ago I bought the WWE Universal Championship Red version, the uh, commemorative version. So so yeah, and uh, I know I'm uh, on my last video I'm gonna, I did the comparison of 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 of, of, of the Jack Pacific uh, WWE Championship and uh, comparing it with the uh, with the commemorative version of the WWE Championship, but, uh, which. If you haven't seen that one, then I'll put the link down below. Also, I mean, if you, if you haven't seen my uh, my my second ever unboxing video, which is the unboxing for the Universal Championship Collectible Belt, then it's like I said, I'll put the link in the description down below. All right, let's compare these two. Okay, let's start comparing these two. Now, this is the Wicked Cool Toy Collectibles Universal Championship Belt. And this is the commemorative red version of the Universal Championship Belt. Well, you can tell, you, yeah, you can tell because uh, I... I I place it underneath uh, this uh, belt bag, and uh, which it came from. So, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and start off with the uh, with the straps now. As you can see here, I mean, like uh, the colors of these straps, it does kind of feel the same thing. I mean, I'm sorry, it does look the same, but uh, I kind of feel like I'm uh, like uh, this one's like like more darkish is. But uh, I know it's hard to tell because you know because because uh because of the camera. So, um, when I first got this last year, I'm mean, like uh, I mean, like it, it did uh, like. I mean, I thought to myself, is it just me or, or, or does like replica belts, you know, or toy version of these belts? I mean, it, it looks, it, it looks more different than like, uh, the, than the one you see on TV with it all, which is like, you know, on Monday Night Raw, you know, like, uh, the, the straps of this uh, Universal Championship is like more reddish and, uh, and this is like, and this one feels like more pink reddish to say the least. So, so, so yeah, uh, anyways, uh, yeah, they both look the same. All right. As for this, uh, this, uh, belt buckle holes and, uh, yeah, um, this one's actually a hard plastic while the commemorative version on, while the commemorative version, uh, with this, uh, is actually a hard, uh, uh, soft metal, I guess, or just hard metal, just to say it. And look over here on the other side, uh, one thing I, I want to point out is, uh, is, uh, the belt tips. Well, while this, uh, Wicked Cool Toy version, uh, just like, uh, the Jack Specific belt that, like, uh, this Wicked Cool Toy version, uh, has, the uh, has the... The hard plastic uh, belt tips. Uh. So yeah, uh, I like to think that I uh, like uh, you know between the Jack Pacific belts and the, and the Wicked Cool Toy versions. Well, I do know that I'm like uh, there's another uh, belt you know from Wicked Cool Toy. You know like that's the same as uh, the Universal Championship, which is the the WWE Championship. Uh. So yeah, uh, well, and of course uh, like uh, this one's uh, also a hard plastic. Uh, well, well, this commemorative version like, has the has the hard metal belt buckles all right on to the plates as yeah i can tell my you, you already know the difference you know like uh, on, the, on the plates because uh you know the commemorative version like uh, it, it looks like like all more goldish uh while this uh wicked cool toy version belt i mean uh, has has like uh, i mean it sounds like even like bright gold yellowish gold plates and uh i mean i'm, I'm a which uh, which I know for sure, like uh, I mean, like this hard plastic, uh, well, this hard plastic uh, Universal Championship uh, collectibles is that is actually uh, a little bit of fragile because uh, because uh, there was one time when uh, I kind of dropped this, uh, I dropped this and uh, and there was a little scratch on it, which uh, which I, w I would not be showing. And uh, so yeah, uh, it's still hard plastic though, 
But this one, yeah, definitely. I never, uh, not a single drop, no scratches. Uh, I've had it for a week and, I'm sorry. I've had it for a couple of days and uh, so yeah. All right. Now let's check the back part. So let me flip this up. Okay, one thing I forgot to mention is that okay, so uh, the difference between these two straps is okay, so is, okay, so uh, this one is uh, is actually like more bendable, you know, like uh, like you see on TV, and uh, yeah, and this commemorative version, uh, yeah, it's kind of pretty stiff though, so it's hard for me, you know, you know, to uh, to bend it, you know, but but it's a but it's good though. All right, the backs, the back sides of this belt. Now on this. Uh, on this version of the belt, so okay, so you can see that, uh, yeah, you can see that it's a uh, it's a uh, property all rights reserved to uh, to Wicked Cool Toys. Uh, so yeah, made in China. Oh, and uh, this was made in 2019, even though I got this in 2020 last year. It's like I said earlier, I'm not really sure that, like, if they still sell this belt these days. I mean, if you'd like to tell me you know, like if they still do it, and if you have one, then please leave a comment down below. All right, the screws in the back. Um, I guess unlike the Jack Pacific one, you know, which is like like all white screws and stuff like that, this one has like a you know like a bearables, you know, like barely seen, you know, like black screws on the back, and yeah, I've already pointed this out, so eh, I'm not really sure what to think of that. I like to think that like um like this wicked cool toy version and uh, is is actually better than the uh, the Jack Pacific one and uh. I don't know. I could be wrong. So leave a comment down below, to, you know, just you know, and tell me which version do you like better. All right, on to the uh, commemorative version. So yeah, yeah, I don't know. It's obvious that uh, like, uh, you see the 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 metal silver screws on the back and uh, like 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 all the other official WWE replicas. You know, yeah, official authentic commemorative championship title by WWEshop.com. Even though I got this on Amazon. Well, I also got this on Amazon. Besides, uh ringside collectible so so yeah uh i've already i've already told you about the about the about the belt tip so i guess everything you see here is you know, like a one is is actually a more, more more than hard plastic and the other one is like uh just hard plastic with a, with a with a bunch of metal material so so yeah that's about it all right on to the question since i will be hanging this uh commemorative red version universal title on on my shelf and uh what am I gonna do with this uh, Wicked Cool Toys uh, Universal Championship belt? So, well, I mean, it's like I said on my, on my last uh, comparison video, which uh, which I compared the WWE title and the, um, well, I could sell this, but but the thing is that I right now is the rarest thing you can find because uh, because uh, I don't know to this day that uh, that uh, if they're still selling something like this. Uh, uh, last I checked it, uh, which is uh, last I checked it was which is on a uh, Ringside Collectibles and like uh, I mean. They didn't have anything. They didn't have like anything on sale, so uh, I'm assuming a uh, wicked cool toys. I mean, uh, and WWE uh, like uh, like like stop selling these toys, and uh, I don't know. But for sure, uh, I'm, I'm not gonna sell this. Uh, what to do with this? Uh, I mean, <laughs> I will be uh, putting it in, in a bet. I will be defending this title. And uh, oh, speaking of bet, okay, just to let you know that uh, like my Jack specific uh, WWE championship, uh, I lost it in a bet. In bowling, so, so yeah, uh, I promise uh, I'll be getting it back though. So and so yeah, uh, yes, uh, I, I will be placing a bet on the, on, on this on this belt also. I'll be defending it. Well, like I said in my last video, anything um, bowling, Smash Brothers, Mortal Kombat, WWE 2K games that uh, which uh, well, which uh, I am I am looking forward to 2K22. I mean, since it got delayed and uh, for good reason, uh, and that's a good thing it got delayed. So. It, you may not like it though, so but uh, sometimes delays are always good. So so yeah. Well then, uh, I guess you can say that uh, I currently owned uh, three Universal Championship: the Wicked Cool Toy Collectibles, the uh, commemorative version of the red ones, well, two red ones, and this blue version of the Universal Championship belt. Uh, let me know down in the comment uh, about, uh, about which color version of the Universal title uh, do you like better? Because uh, as of right now, for me personally. Uh, it's this one because uh, because of one man 
which is the head of the table, our dearest tribal chief, Roman Reigns. Well, I mean, I would be wearing his t-shirt right now, but uh, instead I'm wearing a John Cena t-shirt, which I haven't worn since Halloween. And yes, uh, last year on Halloween, I dressed up as John Cena. So yeah, if you want to, if you want to check that out, then uh, then, uh, then, check it, then check it out in, in my Instagram. So, so yeah, uh, I got three universal title now. All right, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then please hit that like button. If you want to see me do more videos like this in the future, or like uh, unboxing video or reaction video, then, then please like and subscribe. And uh, it's like I said, and I'm not, it's like I said earlier, I mean, if you haven't seen my uh, my, my last year's uh, second unboxing video, which is the unboxing for the Wicked Cool Toy and uh, Universal Championship, then I'll put the link is in the description down below. And also, if you haven't seen my, my last comparison video, was the uh, comparison for the Jack Specific belt and the commemorative uh, WWE Championship. Because like I said, I'll put the link in the description down below or right here at the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, I will see you next time from the big boy. Later. Acknowledge me. I'm just kidding.